What's up YouTube fragrance family? Tommy with Studio Sense here with another video chock full of fragrance goodness. Today I'm going to be bringing you five fragrances that are fantastic, intense, keyword intense, fall weather transitional fragrances. Now you've heard of transitional fragrances, fragrances that are perfect for that autumnal season when the leaves start changing and the weather starts changing from warmer to cooler. These fragrances are perfect to begin using because they start introducing people, you and other people around you, to the idea of more resinous, a little bit darker, maybe even smoky fragrances that are perfect for colder weather. So when we come back, I'm going to showcase these five intense, excellent fall transitional fragrances for men, that and more. So stay tuned. Welcome back everyone. September and fall usually brings brand new seasons of your favorite television shows and some new ones. I know Apple's dropping several cool looking shows, Netflix is doing the same thing, but it's also kind of an introductory time into transitional or phasal fragrances. What is a phasal fragrance? Just like the name indicates, it's when you're going from one phase into another, when you're phasing out something. So we're phasing out our freshies, our aquatic fragrances, not all together, just you know, primarily and we're switching up our rotation into those more resinous, dark, spicy, oriental, smoky fragrances that are perfect for fall and cooler weather. So today we're talking about five such fragrances that are perfect sweater weather, scarf weather fragrances, and all of them, somewhere in the name, have intense. So you know that they're a little bit darker and they're able to punch through your average medium weight jacket for men. The very first intense fragrance we're gonna look at comes from the house of Prada. It is Prada Pour Homme Amber Intense. Amber Intense is among the original laundry fresh, clean, luxury soap smelling scents for men and it is one of the best it still remains one of the best even though it was released in 2011 you've got amber bergamot myrrh patchouli and vanilla and they're all very warm creamy and inviting in their own way the dark heart and intensity of amber porom intense comes from that combination of amber myrrh patchouli and vanilla it is so good that it literally borders on boozy and that's what i love about this fragrance and i highly recommend checking it out it's one of those most it's one of the most wearable prada fragrances ever produced for cooler weather amber pour homme intense next up in our lineup of fall fragrances for men that are perfect for this kind of weather that are intense and enriching is an azaro fragrance a very classic azaro pour homme intense i want to say the original barbershop boozy even though it's not it really kind of feels like it due to the popularity of this fragrance probably the most popular azaro pour homme of the line and there are many of them right at the outset this fragrance opens warm inviting rich and ready to go you've got liqueur you've got amber you've got laotian cinnamon uh, Haitian vetiver. I think there's a Venezuelan tonka bean that also adds to that entire rich, creamy combination of notes. And it's just a really lightly boozy barbershop affair that every man should have or at least try in their fall or cool weather rotation uh, or collection. What I like about the booziness in this, it kind of reminds me just a tad of Carolina Herrera's Privé for men. It's done just right. The booziness in this fragrance is the team player because it supports all of the other notes without outdoing them or outshining them. Excellent fragrance that every man should at least try. Azaro Poron Intense. 2015 saw the release of another fragrance that is a flanker of a date night staple for men and it took it just a little bit farther and made it perfect for cooler weather. And that is the Yves Saint Laurent fragrance, La Nuit de L'Homme L'Intense. L'Intense basically takes that sexy almondy or nutty cardamom, basically adds a little bit of weight to it, highlights just how well the combination of violet and iris work together. And as two floral notes, you would think that they might err, err on the side of feminine. They do not. They are, it's very masculine. This opens with that fresh violet leaf and the heart is where you get the iris or oris concrete or iris it's like an iris butter and in the base you've got a very nice fixed base that is a combination of vanilla patchouli and creamy sweet tonka bean and that's where the sweetness of this comes into play still manages to be very much that sweet la nuit de l'homme that you've always known and love it's just a little bit more intense and it's perfect for cooler weather la nuit de l'homme l'intense what do the fragrant notes of mint, mojito, and rhubarb and the year 2009 have in common? 
Guerlain, Om, and Tense is what they have in common. And not just that, you've got rum, geranium, vetiver, cedar, patchouli, and some other spicy floral notes as well. Spicy notes and floral notes. This is a fantastically blended fragrance. It, the intensity doesn't, it's like a burner. One of those fragrances that you spray on, you're maybe not immediately drawn to, but as it dries off, it becomes this incredible, addictive smelling fragrance. It's really hard to get your nose out of. There's a little bit of resin in here that make it smell like there's a, like a light leather. This wears many hats, and that's why it's such a classic fragrance, and why over 1,500 people have voted it like 4.4, I think, on Fragrantica. It was the last time that I looked. So it's a fantastic fragrance. Basically what I'm saying is if you haven't gotten your nose into Guerlain Am Intense yet, you definitely want to do so for fall weather. All right guys, last of our five fall weather fragrances that are perfect for cooler or autumnal weather that is transitional, phasal fragrances I like to call them. But the last of our five is a fragrance that also from the house of Guerlain and it's one that's kind of changed looks. It might even confuse you when you see it today, but it's Guerlain Lome Ideal Lintense. Remember the very popular Lome Ideal cologne that you used to be able to find in rack stores everywhere six months ago or so, maybe even a year ago now, that is discontinued and now you can't really find hardly anywhere? This is basically the older brother of that fragrance. It still very much carries that sweet, creamy, lightly orange almond DNA, but in the background is this really dense, smoky vibe that is perfect for cooler weather. Speaking of chill, this actually has chili as a note, one of the fragrant notes in it, along with a cardamom and of course the almond that you expect in the fragrance. Also has leather, Bulgarian rose, cistus, patchouli, vanilla, and again, some smoky notes in the background there that just give it a nice weight and kind of makes it uh, ethereal. This is one of those fragrances that you spray on and you think you just you, you think you haven't sprayed enough on and then throughout your day you keep catching whiffs of it here and there it has a mind of its own as to when it's going to let itself be known but it is a very excellently performing fragrance smells amazing all of these fragrances smell amazing and the lintense comes from that weight you know, that, that heavy, lightly smoky blanket that this carries in the background there. And that's what makes it so appealing as well as a transitional fall weather fragrance for men. Well, that's it, guys, for my five fragrances for men that are perfect for fall weather that are intense. And as such, they also make great date night fragrances. Not only are they great fall fragrances or cool weather fragrances, they're also very, in their own way, really sexy. Thanks so much for stopping by and checking out today's list. I really do appreciate you taking the time out to stop by my channel. And as always, thank you so much for your support. I'm Tommy with Studio Sense, and I'll see you tomorrow.